Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here And in today's video I've got four autographs through the mail TTMs to show you And we're also going to open up a box of 2021 um, soccer cards. I opened a couple of them last year and the season's about to start. So we're going to open, open up a box and see if we can get the card signed. Um, as always, we'll start with a TTM. The first one is from Parts Unknown. And we have got Sid Bream. He signed five of five in nine days. He does charge $1 per. He had a career batting average of 264 with 90 home runs, 455 RBIs. He played 12 years, appeared in 1,088 games. He played from 83 to 94. His best year was in 1986. When he hit 16 home runs, knocked in 77, he batted 268, and he had a career high 13 stolen bases. And I think I forgot to tell you, but he also, with the teams he played for, he played for the Dodgers, uh, Pirates, Braves, and Astros. That is Sid Bream. Probably best known for his scoring the winning run in the 1992 NLCS. Against his former team, the Pirates. All right, our second return is from Carroll Stream, Illinois. And we've got Tim Stoddard. He signed three of three in eight days. He had a career batting average or a career record of 41 and 35, was a 3.95 ERA. He played 13 years, appeared in 485 games. He played from 79, 75 to 89. And he played with the White Sox, Orioles, Cubs, Padres, Yankees, and Indians. Um, his best year was in 1980. When he had 26 saves, and he also won a World Series in 1983 with the Baltimore Orioles. And it is Tim Stoddard. I think that's the first time I've written or sent to Tim Stoddard, and I did not send him an Orioles card. All three were Yankees. All right, our third return is from North Houston, Texas. And we've got Roger Metzger. He signed 3 of 3 in 21 days. He had a career batting average of 231 with five home runs, 254 RBIs. He played 11 years, appeared in 1,219 games. He played from 70 to 80. He played with the Cubs, Astros, and Giants. Um, he led the league in triples in 1971 with 11, and he did it again in 1973 when he hit 14 triples. And he also won a gold glove in 1973. Roger Metzger. All right, now we're gonna open up this box. I've had this box for quite a while and just haven't, it's just been sitting here waiting for me to open it. So I believe the season begins next month. So let's go through here and see what we got. And we'll start sending them out. We have Peyton Perea. We have the Pride card. We have the Chicago Red Stars. We have Gomero Stevens. Lindsey Agnew. 
Ms. Lopez, Ms. Schmidt, Carly Nelson, Rose Lavelle, Emily Boyd, we have Erica Timrak, Veronica Latsko, we have Miss King, we have Christy Mewis, Ashlyn Harris, Katie Johnson, Sarah Gordon, we have got the Portland Thorns, we have Paige Monag Monahan, Mallory Pugh, she's a pretty good one, we got Lopez Gold, Allie Krieger Legend, now that card will look pretty good with some blue ink on it. We got uh, Rapino, Rapino. We got Gunner something. And Tierna, Davidson. And that is it. So, you guys know about as much as them, about those players as I do. But um, let's see who we'll see who will sign. All right, our final return is from Orlando, Florida. And we have got Mike Stanley. He signed four of four in 15 days. He had a career average of 270 with 187 home runs, 702 RBIs. He played 15 years, appeared in 1,467 games. He played from 86 to 2000. Um, he played with Texas, the Yankees, Red Sox, Blue Jays, and A's. He was an All-Star in 1995. His best year was in 1993 when he had 26 home runs, knocked in 84. He batted 305. He finished 13th in the MVP voting, and he also won a Silver Slugger that year. That is Mike Stanley. And that, guys, is going to do it for this video, short and sweet. I um, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you've not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.